we reviewed it, and I think it's kicking some booty. We reviewed it, and we kicked some booty. And I want to share it with the community. Over here, we're going to look at Sol. S-O-L. René Sola. Okay, guys? Check this out. Let's start with... I want to see if there's a company overview. There you go. Company pro But David, this is available publicly. Okay, my friend. Go ahead and dislike this video. But The Rock has a message for you. If you are a hater, just watch out. Put a little icy hot on it, turn it sideways, and take it straight up your candy ass. Let's be careful, okay? René Sola, through his subsidiaries, develops, builds, operates, and sells solar power projects. It operates through three segments. Solar power project development, EPC services, and electricity generation revenue. The company also develops community solar gardens and sells projects rights. In addition, its engineering and procurement and construction business includes engineering design, procurement of solar modules, balance of system components and other components, and construction, contracting, and management services. Further, the company generates and sells electricity as of February 28, 2019, it operated approximately 100 solar power projects with an aggregate capacity of 232 megawatts, MW, is that it? René Sola LTD has operations in the United States and Europe. The company was founded in 2005 and is headquartered in Stamford, Connecticut. With that said, I want to go ahead and review this article that I found. So Rerena Sola is a penny stock, right? Just keep that in mind. Always use disposable income. But look, best penny stocks to buy now. Okay, guys? And I'm going to review over here. Penny stocks to buy or avoid. Rene Sola. Solar stocks are on fire recently. The whole trend seems to have exploded. Let me give a, a little bit of a sound effects. Have exploded. <laughs> Following the big battery day presentation by Elon J. Musk. Right, Jordan? The next day, we saw SPI energy and countless alternative energy and EV penny stocks take off. That trend hasn't subsided one bit, and with leading companies like Jinko Solar rallying from under 23 to over 63 in a month's time, you can start to get a sense of where the excitement is right now. René Sola has been one of the alternative energy penny stocks on our list for over a year now. The first time we looked at this company was last September when SOL stock was trading around $1.30. Fast forward to this year and Sol has been on an absolute tier. In fact, the penny stock has tested its three-year high in October. The last time Sol stock traded at these levels was in 2017 when it reached a high of 379, one penny, one penny higher than October's high so far. Should we don't look at me like that because we're not even talking about past stocks, okay? <laughs> this guy, man, this guy. You have to look all the way back to 2014 and to find René Sola trading higher than this price. So with that said, SOL is the one that we're going to review right now. René Sola, guys, it is insane. We talked about it, and I actually, whoa, holy mofong. Oh, you can go. Monster kill. Man, kill, oh, kill, man, kill. it did exactly what we were expected and some guys look at that and let me tell you i actually entered this one as well at two dollars and two cents and we are getting blessed right now a hundred and two percent holy mofongo hadouken. hadouken indeed excellent it is excellent i agree mr burns and we are in an area in the one hour we are actually in an overbought area We can actually retrace back down. Where can we retrace, David? So first of all, what a beautiful break of a resistance over here, guys. 
What a beautiful break of a resistance over here at two dollars, and it is performing very, very nicely. A hundred percent. That obviously, I'm covering already my investments, making sure that I take out some out of the table and keep some to let it ride, break even the stop losses. And what I would like to see from this one is to go back down, maybe back down to three dollars and fifty-five cents, maybe even two dollars and ninety-eight cents. Wouldn't be bad to see. And you know what? Look at this. Look at this EMA cross on the weekly, ladies and gentlemen. Holy mofongo. This is, is this going to be like NIO, guys? Do you remember that we enter an NIO at $2.55 and NIO now is at 20s? Look at this. We are getting into an area of caution. We got to wait for this to reach that $4.50 is going to be a very strong area. Maybe even a little bit higher. Maybe even like $6 could be a problematic price point. But the signs right now are showing bullish momentum. I'm liking that the weekly close above the 200 EMA. So our retracement will be appreciated and lovely. Right, Randy? Oh, yeah!